The Oregon Health Plan says no to chemotherapy and yes to assisted suicide. In a letter to a Eugene cancer patient, the state explains it will not cover the cost of her chemo, but it will pay for doctor-assisted suicide. Her doctor offered hope in this bottle, the new chemotherapy drug Tarceva. Like my doctor said, maybe this can put the lid on it and stop it. That hope shattered with this letter from the Oregon Health Plan, telling her we were unable to approve the cancer treatment. It will pay for comfort care, including physician aid in dying, better known as assisted suicide. We took her concerns to Dr. Sam Saha, chairman of the commission that sets policy for the Oregon Health Plan. Is it cheaper to pay for somebody to die than to help them live? That is uh, not a question that we think about. Um, we don't think about uh, um, We don't think about investing our health care dollars in that way. Yet when thinking about patients like Barbara Wagner, Dr. Saha admits they must consider the state's limited dollars. If we invest thousands and thousands of dollars in one person's days to weeks, uh, yet we are taking away those dollars from someone. Patients who are denied coverage can appeal the decision. In Wagner's case, she appealed twice and lost both times. Her doctors contacted the pharmaceutical company Genentech, which agreed to give her the medication without charging her. Good evening. My name is Jens Hansen. I live in Arroyo Grande. My contention is that all of this health care business has nothing to do with health care. It's about control of our individual liberties. Yeah. Our most precious possession are our lives. And I'll be damned if I want some politician or some unelected bureaucrat in Washington, D.C. or in some state capital telling me how I should live my life. Right. What I'd like to do is to propose an irrevocable amendment or clause for this health care business that effectively says that American citizens have the right to opt in and opt out at will of any health care plan that the government may force down our throats. But I'll bet you that neither of these people here will accept that, which basically says that they are intending to control our lives. Right. 